Hello guys, good evening. Hello from Khiva, from Uzbekistan. At the moment, we are on the way to go have a dinner, have a typical and traditional Uzbek food. And I have my host here. Hello there. <laughs> yeah, I'm staying in, um, what was the uh, guest house name? Islam Khoja. Islam Khoja guest house. And my host been super nice actually to take me for a dinner. So, and also very exciting thing, there is a, they're making a movie here which we're gonna have a look as well check this out do we know what type of uh, movie or what is this? I think some traditional traditional yeah. Yeah. Um. there is a snake also there is what? snake oh, there is a snake? Yeah. real one the boys the ah okay okay wow and we can so what direction we will go now ooh there is a real snake Maxim, <laughs> смотри Salam Aleikum, Salam Aleikum <laughs> Salam Aleikum <laughs> Rahmat, Rahmat, Rahmat Oh my god, Uzbek people are super friendly Doesn't matter where you meet them When What age, they're always super nice Okay This is the Entrance to the old city It has multiple gates and this is one of them and beautiful sunset over there so we just arrived to Chaykhana Ozera which means like a lake tea house in translation to English these are fish? yeah it's sazan ah these are sazan ah, you were telling me they are you have to try when you are in Kiva yeah but I didn't still so maybe we can try today so do they just catch them here and then cook them, right? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, let's go in. I'm inviting myself in. <laughs> you can go first. Can we can we check here? Yeah. Salam yeah. alaikum. Salam alaikum. Ah, this is where is the sazan process? Cleaning process. <laughs> okay, Rahmat, Rahmat. <laughs> Let's not disturb them. Ooh. Wow, look at this. Lake, place to sit. And there's a beautiful sunset. Check this out, guys. Beautiful. Salam alaikum. So they have seats like this one. You can just sit there and enjoy the lake. And we have also yurt. That's how Uzbek people used to live in the desert and this is the more like a touristic version of it beautiful and sitting in on the floor right yeah. but it's more modern there's a tv <laughs> amazing it's beautiful but uh, i prefer to sit outside it's okay. nice weather nice sunset so maybe okay. here or the the chair i think chairs is fine or you want to sit here yeah let's sit here for me doesn't matter yeah, yeah, let's uh, go more local. Okay. <laughs> so we, we need to take out the shoes. Okay. Oh. First thing, take out your shoes always when you are getting in to any Uzbek house as well as here. No, but I was here.
Who's hitting on the floor? Okay, I'm gonna kill him. Okay, what we are eating? What's in the menu? Kebabs? Kebabs and balgama. Fish also. Okay, I want anything Uzbek. Okay. Okay. And you are orange, so you should decide also what you like. Yarim kilo balg peres, ki yarim kilo nevare. Yarim kilo. So there is an interesting story about this lake actually. So while they were building the Khiva city, the main part, the old city, and right. they were digging this place, right? This place. The sand. Yeah. And then afterwards it turned it to the lake, right? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Crazy story. Like they were just taking the sand from here and building the city and then later on unintentionally they made the lake which we are sitting next to it right now. It's also a very special month of the year in Uzbekistan. It's a Ramadan at the moment and my friend been fasting and right now sun goes down and it's the time to open the or to break the fast basically. Yeah. So you will just open it with water, right? Water. And do you say something or Yeah, we have like some dua. Le, dua. Okay. Amazing. And how many hours uh, you didn't eat? So starting from like 5, 6 a.m. or? 5, 6 a.m. 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Yeah. So, so yeah. it's, it's eight, already eight, yeah. 14 hours around? Yeah. yeah. Amazing. I cannot imagine myself <laughs> not eating 14 hours. Yeah, but I, 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 I'm happy what you did. The first round of the food is here. So we have a fresh salad, some sauces, Uzbek bread and of course tea. Since I am in Uzbekistan, I only drink tea like I forgot about all the soft drinks like cola, Fanta, only, only tea, which is amazing. Thank you. So what did we order for dinner? What's coming? Fish. Fish. And kebab. And kebab. Okay. You need to try it all. Okay. Okay. Looking forward. I'm hungry. I didn't fast, but I'm more, more hungry than you probably. <laughs> <laughs> so we have the first meal here. What's the name of this meal? Uh, Kaimak kebab. Kaimak kebab. Okay. Nice. So this is basically beef. And this piece is, this is cheese. cheese, right? Yeah. And cheese, I see some uh, nicely put vegetables there, tomato, cucumber, amazing. <laughs> so this is the first meal, let's try. Yeah. We've been eating and talking about life, wedding life here, <laughs> and in general about life and things and parents, which goes well with beautiful food as well. So we have a second meal just arrived. So this is fish, sazan it's fish, lazar, yeah. sazan. and it's fried. We will try and see how it goes. And this food was really good. It's basically it was beef with cheese, and with also some dairy product, more like a kefir. Um, in in Turkish, it's called uh, suzma or suzma, suzma which was very delicious and I will try right now the fish and let you know how was it as well. So we had a Sazan fish which was super good and also the beef amazing and they are doing some kebab here, real shashlik. That smells really good. And how much? How much did we pay? What was the total? Ten dollar. Ten dollars. So for two people, we paid ten dollars with the drinks and two main courses and salad as well. Amazing. And what's happening here? What is this? They're frying the, the fish. Are they are frying the fish here. Yeah. Thank 
So thank you so much for inviting me. Yeah, paying for my dinner. Yeah, no, never host invited me for dinner and paid for it. This is first time. It's true hospitality of Uzbek people. So thank you so much. Amazing. So we'll see you later, guys. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.